The terms wind energy or wind power describe the process by which wind is used to generate clean, non-polluting electricity. Wind speed and direction have a major impact on wind power. In this experiment, we are going to investigate how the wind's direction affects the turbine's output. For this experiment, we will need a NovaLink data logger, a triple range voltage sensor, and the TerraNova wind kit. First, we're going to connect the wind turbine module to the main board. Make sure it's facing you when you put it in. Then we're going to attach the rail to the wind turbine module, making sure that's in a 90 degree angle. Now we're going to place the turbine on top of the rail and then plug in the leads. Now we're going to attach the fan to the rail, making sure the plugs are to the back. As such. Finally, we're going to connect the voltage sensor leads to the board and then to the NovaLink. It's now time to program the data logger. On your computer, set the sampling rate to 10 samples per second and the sampling time to 100 seconds. First, we're going to need to click Run in the Multilab software to start recording data. In order to vary the wind direction, we're going to rotate the turbine. We'll start by setting the angle of rotation to zero degrees. Now we'll connect the power supply to the fan. And here we go. Notice what happens to the turbine as we gradually change its direction. Now let's look at our results. The graph shows that the voltage of the wind turbine decreases as the angle between the turbine and the fan increases. Our wind turbine generated the maximum voltage when the wind was perpendicular to the plane of the turbine's rotors. Well, hope we blew you away.